Hello, hello. This is the second day here at the February intensive Zhongxin Dao, uh, and this is just the morning recap, February eighteenth, uh, two thousand seventeen, and we ate breakfast and we started off right away with uh, the talk of the morning, uh, and after that we immediately jumped into flowing, and what does it mean to f uh, flow? And getting on top of the other person, uh, and you know, bottom hand trying to get on top, and or strike. We're also allowed for striking. So first, we started off by going up and down, left and right, just slightly, and then afterwards, we went straight into free flowing. He called it. Uh, this training exercise allowed us to strike when we needed to, or when we wanted to. Uh, and the strike can be simply an entrapment to, to, for the person's awareness to go away from the point of contact so that you can come around and from the bottom hand get on the top to get top hand, which is part of the objective. So the striking is not the only objective, but also to use that striking perhaps to come on top. So that was something that was quite interesting. And let's see what else we did. It was that and um, and jamming. So when they are coming in, when when you are bottom hand, you can sort of jam the person to sort of get your way on top. Uh, so jamming is another sort of technique. One thing that I found out was that it's easy for us to go really really fast, and oftentimes when you go fast, you start to lose the sixty one. You know the relaxation, the the, the center of gravity, um, your alignment, uh, and you can get into sort of like a play game trickery sort of mentality, and that takes away from your learning. So the best thing to do is, if you are losing your alignment, go slower. If you're losing that relaxation, go slower. But also. And and when you when you talk with someone, can you you can immediately when you start, you know, commencing with your new partner, you can say, hey, do you mind if we go slow? Because I'm just learning. I'm not at a very high level yet. You know, I'm still trying to unify my body and mind. And usually, I've never heard of anyone say anything otherwise. But yes, oh yeah, sure, that's fine. So, I would recommend that. Um, also, if you wanted to see if you can maintain your 61, if you're at that level that you're able to try to maintain your 61 during all the the craziness of, of spinning hands with another person, contact with another person, then by all means try a little bit, especially at the lower levels, to try to keep your 61 while engaging uh, this other um, individual that you're that you're spitting hands with. So it does work both ways. You can go slow and not go slow, but there is a higher risk associated with going fast if you're at a lower level that you will um, lose your 61, lose your um, you know, present formless neutral, you know, uh, and uh, your present permanently form a formless neutral. So that's what you want to uh, just be wary of. Uh, and part of the this, this training is to get the meet and match. How do you get to this, you know, to the center of the bone in order to, to know, to know the present, ma you know, present moment, to understand the nature, uh, the way uh, the, that the situation is, the conditions are uh, at that point in time, um, which will be constantly changing. And if it changes very fast, then maybe your meet and match practice, you know, you won't be practicing meet and match so much, but you'll be practicing your 61, which you can revert back to. But if you try a very fast method to, to try to maintain both, but you give up the one, that would hurt you more than, more than um, you know, would, would waste your time, basically. So one step at a time, and even if you're trying to you know, reach up and reach ahead and be ambitious, it's, that's wonderful. But make sure that you keep your 61 uh, relaxation, center of gravity, alignment, upper center point, center of mass, internal, external sphere, the spinning force of coordination, present, formless, neutral, and this one such as feel. Have that, along with the other elements that, that you would learn uh, in the system guide. And uh, just keep well. This is just a short little video, the recap. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.